Welcome to The Lightning Round, brought to you by Moviga. I'm Steven with your weekly source for all things movies, video games, and more. Now grab your ponchos and let's catch up on this week's news. Ewan McGregor recently confirmed that early scripts for Obi-Wan Kenobi centered more around Luke than Leia. Was this show ever about Obi-Wan Kenobi? Uh The world's second biggest theater chain, Regal Cinemas, is declaring bankruptcy. So I know we've all seen Minions already, but we need to go see it four or five more times. We've got to save the theaters, y'all. Hold on to your declarations of independence. Jeremy Bruckheimer has confirmed a National Treasure 3 script is in the works, and he's hoping to get Nicolas Cage back for it. Uh, I'm, I guess I'm down for that. Sure. The giant video game holdings company Embracer Group has purchased the rights to The Lord of the Rings and The Hobbit and is eager to explore movie tie-ins, spin-offs, video games, all that stuff. Which is pretty cool, so we'll see what happens. Disney is re-releasing Rogue One with an Andor sneak peek and Spider-Man No Way Home with 11 minutes of extra footage. How y'all feel about all these re-releases? I don't know. I I feel like it's kind of sketchy, but also the theaters are kind of dying, so I don't know. What do you think? Spider-Man is now on PC and is the second biggest launch for a PlayStation game behind God of War. Well deserved. Those are both amazing games. You should go play them if you haven't already. There has been a massive breakthrough in nuclear fusion. Scientists at the Lawrence Livermore National Laboratory's National Ignition Facility have achieved ignition, meaning the reaction has become self-sustaining, and you know what that means. The power of the sun in the palm of my hand. Well, it looks like the storm has passed. Be sure to check out the Moviga podcast on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, or anywhere you listen to that sort of thing. Where we're talking all things movies, video games, and more. I'm Steven, and thanks again for joining me this week for The Lightning Round. Thank you.